San Francisco School of Fine Design. These are my students right over here. Uh, we're going to do a, a bridal bouquet. We're doing a wedding in Sonoma tomorrow at Satui Winery. So I wanted to emphasize to my students how wicked easy it is to do a bridal bouquet. So the colors are champagne white, and I've got uh, my always my workhorses, a hydrangea stock, roses, and a little pip. I'm going to start with a triangle. How hard is that? I'm going to take it and collar it with my wrestle. Grab me two more hydrangeas. I'm going to collar with hydrangeas. I'm half done already. It's a $150 bridal bouquet. See that? Nestle it in. Is that all right? Yep. Like that. Now, all I, oh, give me one more. Spare no expenses for the bride. I used to work for some florist and they'd say, how much is that? You're $10 over budget. I'm like, do we really care? This is the thing, this is the bouquet she's going to be carrying all day. So if you add a couple extra roses, do not worry about it. It's, she'll be, it's your business card. She'll be looking at it all day. Uh, Russell, pick me out some nice champagne roses. Now I'm going to fill in the cracks with some champagne roses. And for the bride, I like to cluster them, two or three on each crack, like that. Oop. Oh, that's just nice. Clean them up a little bit if they need it. I'm going to switch hands, go to the other side. Fill in the cracks. Notice how I'm inserting these through the design. Like that, thank you. I'm going to keep adding them through my design. And then I think I'm going to run a couple of them right up on top. See how I'm pulling that through from the bottom? Right there. Another one up on top. Push it through. Find it poking out the bottom. Pull it in right there. And last but not least, um, some I think stock. We're done. Yep, we're done. I'm collaring it with stock, white stock, beautiful white stock. The flowers here in San Francisco are always so perfect. Like that. It's getting there. But how long have I been working on this? <laughs> Five seconds. 30 seconds. <laughs> Five seconds. About a minute and a half. So I'm going to collar some beautiful stock all around the outside. And then I'm going to give it a little haircut. I want it still nice and round. I don't want it. Oh, can you give me a little pit, somebody? Find me some pit, pit chunks. It's pretty big, I think. My friend Sam can handle it. I'm going to put a little pit. Under around the edges, pull up, make a wishbone, pull. There you go, like that, like that. Give me a little bit more, and then Russell grabbed me a couple of wires. I always usually need an assistant to wrap this. I mean, to tie it up. Right, you were talking about, you were talking about how much more profit you make on one of these than a hair wreath where you're taping and wiring all day. Uh, what does it need? I'll let my students decide. More champagne, more white? More champagne. More, more champagne. champagne. I think so too. I was hoping you would say that. I'll drop a few, a little more color right in the middle. Really little. Very good. One more here. Okay, who's got the wires? There's a wire. Wire, wire, pants on fire. Now I'm going to hold it like this. You're Russell, you're going to take those wires right above my hand. Wait a minute. Yeah, let me do that. Right. Here, here, here. here. No, in the middle of the wires. Yes. Take two wires, two or three. Yeah, here, here, here. Yes. Second one. Yep, take another one. This is a big bouquet. Now I'm going to flip it over, and my assistant's going to give it one. Get a close on that. Yep, give it one good twist, nice and tight. Perfect. Got it? Just give them like a cross them over. Got it? Let's see. It. Nice and tight. And there we are, San Francisco. Bridal design uh, from Flower School 101. Say goodbye, everybody. Bye. Bye.